all right ladies and gentlemen welcome back to a new video today we're going to be playing some graves jungle i'm going to be showing you guys how i'm going about playing graves jungle and my reclimb into masters and potentially back to gm2 i'm not entirely sure if i will take it that far though um yeah we're currently uh we're like d1 50 lp or something we basically decayed and then lost a game or something to that nature anyway we're gonna be starting raptors this game and doing three camps into bot hopefully ganking bot successfully into then resetting now obviously if the gank doesn't work that's going to suck for us quite a lot but Decent chance it does work, and even if it doesn't work, trying to deny the uh, Draven lane leads is definitely quite a useful thing. Also, my top lane likely auto winning, and I think my mid lane is likely auto losing. That gives you guys some more input as to why I'm making this passing choice. I could also cut up into Vi's bot side jungle, but the issue with doing that is that my bot lane is stronger. You know, that just makes that not that ideal, right? I had auto spraying there, but otherwise it looks pretty chill. No ward out yet. Just gonna sit in this bush for a moment's time. Wait some cooldowns, and then we're looking for it. Beautiful. Oh, what? Yikes, bro. I don't know why. He's trying to give the kill or something. I'm not even wanting the kill. But that's fucking creep wave in the road. Uh, don't have fucking mana. I'm gonna overstay here a little bit because I think I might be able to kill Vi on her blue. An ally has been slain. Oh, my mid died. I might be able to EW this guy though. I think I got hit. No, I didn't. Wow, that's huge. I think Braum kills this fire too. He needs to, like, continuously hit him if he wants to kill. Might go straight into the bot gank and then clear up. Yeah, pretty big issue that Draven traded 1 for 1, I'm not gonna lie. Like, game changing. Let me just quickly grab this camp and hover the dive. Wait for Braum to get back. Alright, beautiful stuff. Shadow my Diana here. Alright, good, good, good.
I don't really want to do grobs here, ladies and gentlemen, but I do want to check just to make sure Vi is not doing them. Nice. Plain winning. That's expected there. Now, because of that top lane kill, I may look for the grubs though. Do have some prior now. Why well, maybe on drag? A decent trade for her. Buys on this dragon. Fuck me. That's very cringe by my team. Also getting boxed in on the top side. No, I wasn't. This guy didn't come apparently. <coughs> this is what it is. Would have been really nice if I was able to get that drag. Dig. Diana should be, not Diana, pardon me, Vi should be around here somewhere. She is. That's gone already. Great stuff. My bot lane have to be a little bit careful here. Pretty hard for me to get the dive off on this guy, but I am just gonna hover it whilst I recall. My base gold here sucks. What the way to put it? I'm rotating. I don't really think this dive works for the enemies, but I know where this dog champ is. I'm gonna sit on this ward. I ultimately want to get here, so I don't really care that they see me. We'll skip our wolves, doesn't really change anything. We should be able to contest this.
Getting the six scrubs pass back is really, really big for my team comp. Diana loves scrubs. Yelt, beautiful. We do have Dragon at 40 seconds. Alright, they're resetting. As long as my bot doesn't die here. Great play for us. Snowballs, the Renekton, it's gonna be basically a whole tower there, I think. By the time everything's said and done. A reset? It's not, yeah. But, uh... I don't really have great reset, ladies and gentlemen, so we're not going to take it. We're just going to clear down into the drag. Big. Looking a little bit cringe. I need to go bot issue. Fires behind. It's okay, Diana's getting a huge siege off right now. There we go, there's two turrets for our team. And should also be a drag here. That's the power of getting those six uh, void grubs, ladies and gentlemen. Can't always be done, isn't always the best option, but in this specific game it was a great option based off how everything went. Also picking up a second drag here. I think they should be a little bit careful. I don't really have too much time to be bought right this second. I don't need 150 gold. Which I only need 100. Uh, so I just need this one camp then, and then I immediately reset and go towards the uh, Rift Herald. We pretty much just don't need to fight Draven right now, and then we win the game by default. This is his power spike. I think this guy will live, he's pretty fed. I'm gonna keep reminding them not to fight bot. I can yoink this whilst my teammates kills everyone here. GG, easy gaming. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Get the Diana on here, I think. Does that put us on? 82 LP, good stuff. Damage numbers are pretty low, but kind of standard at the moment damage for Graves Jungle in this elo as far as I've seen. Pretty happy with that game, other than the death of Dragon. I think I could have played that a little bit better. Maybe I could have killed the Vi if I played it a little bit faster.
Outside of those things, I'm not too concerned. Not sure about the level 1 skirmish, but I also don't really think it's worth for reviewing. Uh, not level 1, level 3, pardon me. But potentially there's some issue with that level 3 skirmish. Maybe I could have found the auto on um, Draven a little bit sooner. Not really sure why my bot lane were wanting to give. I don't think that's actually the right play. Yeah, that's going to be it for today's video, ladies and gentlemen. If you like it, make sure to like and subscribe. Also, if you'd like coaching, you can check out the coaching at coachmarga.com. Till next time, take care, good luck on the rift, and peace out.